Good morning, everyone. Hope things are going well with you. Welcome back to the Spirit Fair. I am Death. I'm, and this is my cat. <laughs> What's up, Numbs? What's up, Rain? What's up, Apollo? What's up, Lurkers? And this is my seafaring cottage. Wow. Oh, parkour. Let's see, what do we leave off on? Uh, fish. Fish. It's a fighter. It's a fighter. Getting that Lego person. Here we go. Ooh, a soul. Hmm. I didn't know that's how I got souls. I figured I just had to pick them up somehow. Not fish them up. Ha! When am I going to explain the joke I made about this game last time? Oh, it made me clap my feet like a baby. <laughs> made me clap my feet like a baby! <laughs> oh, it's so good! You know, like, babies got the big, those, those big fat asses, and they just kind of lay there, and, like, they can just kind of, like, <laughs> Here, let me do it for you. <laughs> but, like, they can clap their feet together, like, like, <laughs> like this. <laughs> like that. Urgh, it's so good! Sleepy time. Just, uh, just don't worry about it. It's fine. All right, everyone up. Time to go. Hey, what's up, man? Yo. Hey, how you doing, boss? Hmm, let's put some tea leaves in here. Let's try out doubt. Let's tr try out doubt. Hmm, see that. Oh, we're already here. Well, that was quick. Mount Toriyama discovered. Whoa! Put down the lettuce. Hello, my steak friend. All right, I'll let you do that. Gwen, how you doing? You want some food? There you go. Have some, uh, have some coffee. No, uh, you can have some coffee. There you go. One damn fine cup of coffee. It's the best. Here's a hug, as well. How are your moods? Yeah, your maximum. My snake friend. Have some food. Here's some berries. Mm. Okay, here you go. I can't say no to a dessert! Okay. You're welcome, my snake vegan friend. Wait, you get a hug! Don't I feel better now? No, it's supposed to make you feel better! A two! Wait. Uh, a tool, yes! Food! Ah! The tool's the best. 
I love food. Keep it coming. Nom, 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 nom. And here's a hug. And he keeps banging everywhere. Yes, the frog is the best, in my opinion. A tool is no tool. That's right. Rankings so far. A tool number one. Then Gwen. Then Snake. I don't even remember the snake's name. <laughs> Whoa. Sheep reminds me of like the old Looney Tunes. Uh, Wily e. Coyote and the Sheep Dog. Sheep. Secrets? No secrets. But my hat might got big old hat. Yeah, hello there, young lady. How are you doing? Oh, yes, right. Perhaps you can help me. You must have stumbled upon a fluffy sheep in the loot down there. I tried getting it back to its enclosure, but the stubborn creature wouldn't listen to me. Chances on your side, its weak spot is its gluttony. So it will definitely follow anyone who would feed it. Would you be a deal to give it a try? Okay. I'll go inside your house first. Damn. <laughs> Fluffy sheep. Sheep. Feed. Corn. This is an enclosure over here. Or do I need to like pick it up? Nope. The snake's name is Summer. Ah. Where's it over here? Ah, here we go. Ah, of course. Oh, what a nice sheep. It followed you all the way to its home. You're always following your stomach, aren't you, little guy? My sons were just like that. Hmm, don't you think it looks lonely? Maybe that's why it left. I'm going to keep it company. Don't worry. But maybe if you've had another stray sheep, you could bring it back here. They could entertain each other. If it's not, not too much of an inconvenience. I'm Alice, by the way. Very nice to meet you. Hey, you know my name's Alice. How you doing? What is the goal of this game? I am death. And my my uh, my goal is to ferry the spirits to the other side. But first we got to make them comfy and cozy and ready to go. And that's my cat Daffodil. Also death. No, not that kind of... Not, not D-E-A-F. D-E-A-T-H. Death. Or I'm just the ferryman. I think it's more that I'm the, the, the ferryman. The spirit ferrer, so to speak. Uh. Like, uh... Charon was the uh, the previous spirit fairer. Whoa, an opal! <gasps> Apple seeds! Yes! Good coal, good coal. We're going over here. So what we got going on over here? Can't do that yet, I bet. I bet you that's the, uh, use the hat floaty. I can grow an apple seed. Or an apple tree, yeah. I just gotta plant my seed in fertile ground. Ah, yes. Perfect. Alright, enough of that. Hmm. 
Okay. We're gonna have to, I'm assuming, find the, n the next skill in order to proceed. Hey, what's, it, what's going on, PlayStation? Don't phrase it like that. Like what? I have an apple seed. I plant it in fertile soil. It grows an apple tree. Stella, I was thinking. What were you thinking? Summer. Chops for seeds. Yeah, Gwen. Let's see. Slice it up. Slice it up. Put down some tea. Put down some coffee. Yummy lettuce. Vegetables. Hmm. Let's see. Build. Nebula thread. Sheep corral. Place to keep your sheep from eating all your crops. Well, I don't have any sheep yet. <laughs> Harness the power of the wind. Produce the finest flowers. Hmm. I'm assuming the next thing would need to be... Windmill, maybe? We'll figure it out. No improvements. No. Need linen fabric. Need to figure out how to make that. Lightning in a bottle. All right, we're moving on to the next location. Is that a sea slug? Now we're going to uh, the Iwashima countryside. Here we go fishing. Crates, 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 crates! Thank you, Atul! I will join you. Why don't you fish anymore? It's really common. You just cast a line and you wait. Hmm. But I have been fishing. I literally just fished. Where's my kitchen? I don't. I don't know where my kitchen is. Which one's the kitchen? There it is. I cook.
I cooked the soul. No, we're already here. Iwashima, countryside. Adventure awaits! Yes, the cat sings too. Good old Daff. Skills. What I love about spitting is the talent you need. You know, it takes real skill to find a target, aim, and hit a bullseye. That's a skill and raw talent right there. I just love that I'm good at something. I could spit off tall buildings forever. On the off chance that I might hit someone right on the head, it, I seem to never run out of spit. The small bridge isn't very high, nobody ever swims down there. Still, it's pretty satisfying to spit. I'm fully equipped. I've got my mouth, I've got my bottle of water, I'm ready, and I've got the spirit to do it for you. That's disgusting. What is wrong with you? Look at all these trees. Achoo, watch out! Oak. Good oak. Back to the boat. It's sleepy time. Sleepy time for everyone. Loom it up. Yoink. Yoink. Why not? Ooh, my mystery seeds. It's nothing. Excellent. Get some of that. A little bit of this. Uh oh. My fish is burning! Let's see, what else? Uh, you know, I guess coffee would be good. Let that coffee. Coffee.
copied. Perfect. Yes, Apollo, what's going on, my friend? Go do a little. Hey. Wow. Let's see. There's a couple spots I need to go to, actually. The bottom line car. Oh, that's right. The, uh. I guess we should go to the bus stop and travel that way. First. Yeah, we'll go here. Then we'll, uh, teleport. What'd you miss? Uh, there's a sea lion. It's a bit crazy. Hey, how you doing, Luda? Let's go here. Okay, that's that. Was he acting like a dog? It's a sea lion. They go, they they bark. Go see what's going on with the uh, the raccoons. Apple and bread is the best mix of food. You have good choices, my friend. I chew. I was in your recommended. Well, hello, my friend. I'm glad you clicked. Good to see you. You don't need to do live Twitch is so much better. I do restream to uh, Twitch. I actually restream to Twitch, DLive, and YouTube. There we go. And there you go. And there you go. What are you doing, Atul? How you doing, my friend? You want some uh, popcorn? Ah! No, I just love food. Keep coming. I can't get enough of it. Remembers his old family. Oh, here's a hug. What's going on, Gwen? Yes, I know it's. It's always powered by the Everlight. Here's your comfort food. And here's a hug. She's got six ears. Snick. What is the snick? 
there's the snake. Bottom line. Hey, how you doing, Ty? Give the snake uh, a hug. Is this the game about dying? No, it's not about dying. It's about... I mean, technically, you are dead. And you're... Moving the spirits to the final, their final destination. I guess it's more about the acceptance of it. Ah, there he is. Proof that beautiful does not mean expensive. Formed during the mantle's tie-dye phase. Excellent salesperson always carries what the customer needs. So my well-off patron, what can I do for you? This is the Tom Nook of this world. Where did I go? I'm... What happened? Ah! I fell behind the world. The time has come, my friend! Let's trample the thorns of any inequity! Let's burn the tangling ropes of low-wage employment! Let's tear down the golden walls of the upper class! Your conditions here have been appalling! It's time for you to revolt! Let's show this capitalist pig that it's your work that creates wealth and value! Your work that makes him a profit! And he is the one living off your backs! Let's break his knees! <laughs> Do not despair, my friends! Together we can revolt this unjust stream of enrichment! Together we can finally give the power back to the working class! Power you the summon wealth you should- <laughs> Time to claim one's life for yours! I want the line of sunglasses! <laughs> yeah, let's get his wallet! You better not be on my boat. Oh, shit. Break his back! Make him humble! Hey, how you doing, Tool? Mm. Ah, the glass is all... Uh, the glass is all busted up. That's not up to code. Mm. If I was their union leader, believe you me, I'd make that greedy boss eat his own shoes. Here, have some more food. He eats a burgie. Spin. 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 So I'm gonna get a, uh, a Kami onto my boat now. Hello there! You've come to join our boat test! No. No worries! I even have a little something you think you arrived. You're flying up there, the CEO of the company. He's fled to his office and won't come out! The coward! See if you can fix the faces of the boys and have an honest dialogue with them. I don't know if we want to have an honest dialogue with someone that's screaming break his back. Or break his knees. Okay. Glass is all busted up. That's not up the code. Hmm. Probably have to. Somehow get up to the roof. The woof. Maybe come back later. What's up, Regu? Dude, I can't wait for our next game. My friend Buck. I've been preparing us a new game for us. I'm sure you'll tell us soon. Oh. <laughs> Go away! Never mind, he's up here. No, leave me alone! 
What do you want? Get away from here. I've done nothing wrong. I am the one being threatened. As if three fewer days of vacation a year was a big problem, though. I mean, they shouldn't have thought twice before starting a family, right? I'm not responsible for the proof of life choices, nor for their lack of higher qualifications. And they should be happy I've not delocalized the production. What will I have to do next? Pay them medical insurance? Why would I pay them if they don't work? It doesn't make a difference if they have a broken arm or a whooping cough. They still don't work here and they're not here. Um, hmm. Ah, uh, yes. Boss man bad. What? What? Mm -hmm. We won't move. Not without having negotiated. Okay. So I go back up there now? They just want to negotiate, you say? Look, it's getting hot in here, and I'm getting hungry, too. Oh. Okay, you can tell them I'll reverse my decision on the vacations. I'll wait for you here. Yes, yeah, the very wholesome game about ending the existence. Nope, not enough! Plus 20% increase in wages and full compensation for medical expenses, as well as another week of vacation and 5% on capital gains! Ah, yes, bully until you get what you want. I've really got to pee. Okay, whatever they want. Tell them they'll get whatever they want. But they have to stop calling me Mr. Moneybags, got it? Okay, go now. I will find the key to the door. Mm -hmm. Hey, to everything you said. Wonderful. You're one hell of a negotiator, munchkin. Mm -hmm. I like you already. Look, my work is done here, thank you. You're in work here. I probably could have walked with you on this fancy boat of yours. Can't wait to rest my old bones in a cozy home and have you by my side. See you there. I don't want you on my boat. You'll just complain, I bet. Saying death should be given back to the hands of the people or some shit. Your boat is too capitalistic. I don't like it. Oh. Hey, you tell someone to unlock the door. I really need to pee. Sorry. I guess just pee in there. Ooh, wonton soup and an old painting. Get off my boat! Alright, let's see what it is. Alright, take a guess. What do you think? What kind of animal? Mm, I'm gonna say like a lion, maybe? I mean, last time it was the snake T-posing in a coat, so it could be anything. Maybe like a giant beaver? Fox because it's a conniving little sleaze bag. <laughs> Took you long enough! It is a lion. No, wait. Woof? What? Woof. Woof! That's so funny. You'd think I would have everything at my... Seen everything at my age. I'm sure I like it, though. It sure beats being in personal hooded blob. Those capes are really scratchy. Feels good to breathe the fresh air. Mm -hmm. So it's a cat. Or a wolf. A wolf? Wolf. I'm hungry. You know what? <laughs> Would you be a deal and fix me a little meal? I don't know, that's pretty, uh, demanding of you. It, give him- give him a hot voice? It's a female. It's an old woman. It's an old lady. It's a wolf in a sheep's den. Oh my god, it is! 
It's like one of those old, like, aristocratic ladies. See? It's starving. Or, I don't know, maybe it's like some guy just like, oh, you know, I just like it. Well, it's a bit overcooked, isn't it? And kind of bland. Wow, I hate you. We're going to the gate, right now. You're getting the boot. You snake in the grass. Make it a scene when someone mentions her appearance. Mm -hmm. Even in death, you cannot escape the commies. Hmm. She's <laughs> such a weird creature. <laughs> Alright, here's a hug. So, it, it is a lion. Wolf. Lion? Lion. A combination of the two. Maybe like a bobcat. Maybe it's a cougar. She went woof. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Whatever. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's a cougar looking for a cub. It's some delicious mackerel. All right, let's see. Where's our next destination? Well, it's too dark, so. Sleepy times. It's gonna put us work at the factory. She's gonna be like, Spirits, rise up! Spirits, rise up! <laughs> Leave me alone! <sighs> you cannot negotiate with the concept of death. Whoa! What's down here? South Point Docks. Let's see, uh... Let's go to... I should go to Hummingbird. There is a sheep there, but I need the sheep corral. Which I can make, actually. Let's go here real quick. Ding dong. Wake up. Everyone up. Let us continue, shall we? Whoa. Hello, Summer. A tool? You're my favorite. Here's some berries. A tool is the best. Look at him, hard at work. Hello, Stella. Here's some uh, fine dining restaurants I've been to. I've been to a lot. Thanks a lot. She liked it. Dislikes anything with shellfish. But I just gave you shellfish. No, wait. Yeah, no, no. Shrimp? No, shrimp's not shellfish. Wait, isn't shrimp shellfish? I 
Or is that just like crabs and lobsters? Because there's a shell on Frick, uh, shrimp. Has eaten a meal she likes. <laughs> I don't like that. <laughs> that, uh, that creature. Rubs me the wrong way. Get over here, Summer. I must speak with you. No, su Summer! Summer! Stop it! Eat food. Here. <laughs> Not right now, please. Don't touch me. I like the vegan snake more than I do the, uh... Why are we not moving? Are we moving? Not yet. Wait. We're not moving. Ah, we can't get through. I see. Alright, that's what that is. Olga? Let's go see what Olga is. Let's see if I can build that sheep corral. Oh, it's tiny. Okay. There you go. Yeah, what's up, Rain? Lightning storm! Time to catch lightning. Some video? Nah, I'm not gonna be able to. Good job, my furry little friend. It's lightning in a bottle. It's crafting, crafting stuff. Too. 
Let's see here. I need 10 ingots. No, can't do that yet. 8,000 glims. Iron ingot. Wolf fabric. So I just need glims. Do not like this bobcat. Ah! Er, there we are. Happy to see her, Munchkin. She's always been a kind person and we go way back, me and her. But I've got to tell you, last time we saw each other, things didn't go that well. She might still hold a bit of a grudge against me. It's not my fault. If I say things are as they are, you don't always make friends by being honest. You might even lose a few. But we're old now, so canoe under the bridge, as they say. Follow my lead. Yeah, sure. Perfect. Olga, you haven't changed a bit, old friend. Still so green. Yeah, it's good. My dear Astrid, I'm glad to see you. I'm glad to see that you, you're out of your old shell. Would you happen to owe this to this charming young lady here? You are the new spirit, fair are you not? Albert was telling everyone that Charon has been replaced. Stella, isn't it? But I think he borrowed my hairbrush and never gave it back. Oh well. I hope this new job of yours doesn't weigh too heavily on your frail shoulders. You can count on me to give you a hand any... My little lady. So tell me, Astrid, what brings you here? As you said, I'm back from the world. The first thing I wanted to do was pay you a little visit. You know, to catch up on things. How are you and your sisters doing? Oh, you know, Irina and I still focusing on her studies, and Master has picked up a new hobby. Knitting. She says it keeps her stress levels low. Not that she's ever done anything really stressful, mind you. But she crossed nice little mitts for me for the winter. You should pay them a visit as well. Oh, and Astrid. Yeah? You won't believe what I've heard the other day. What is it? Miss Shrewsbury is pregnant. Again. No, nanny. I can't believe it. Yes. And you know what? Bob is not the father. <gasps> no. You're kidding me. Incredible. Oh, well, she's always knew how to lure them boys. Speaking of boys, I heard Giovanni's back and from a reliable source of that. Giovanni's back? Who told you that? Well, when? Well, if you're interested, I can go dig deeper. But are you interested? Yes. No. No, I don't care what he does. I don't want to know. He can frolic all he wants. As you wish. But you know what? I'll go check my sources and write back to you, Justin Kyle. Now that I'm, now that you're traveling is in good company, I'll know what I do. Okay, no rush. Eh. Orca dear, could you show her what you can do? I'm certain your help would be greatly appreciated. Of course, and uh, the main attraction. Come here, little lady. I'm not very old, but I'm not very well. I'm not strong. Uh, so I'm taking a kind of a chance. Just, 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 just finish buff room. You'll talk about right now. Put your receptacles on my back. You plant logs, ores, and rocks in them, and then you wait. You wait for me to come back to the surface, and when I'm back, the rocks, or logs, or you uh, treat them. Blah, blah. It's normal, sister. I like strawberries. Ah, plant the trees. Okay. Uh, here you go. Put one of these, and I'll put, uh, I guess. Was the game requested? Yes. Oh, 
Are you done? Yes. Wonderful. I'll go back on the water for some time. Do not worry. I'll re-emerge as soon as what you planted can be fully harvested. Take care of yourself and your passenger, Stella. Bye now. See you soon. Okay, bye. Daffodil's gone too. <laughs> wow. Bye, Daffodil. I do not like her. She had a lot to say, did she? Running her mouth like that. She's always been chatty, this one, but I don't judge. Also, I don't know if you've noticed, but her eyes are a bit scary. Soothing and kind, for sure. But scary. I think she should talk to someone about this, but enough about her. <sighs> oh, what's going on? I can't get enough of it. Also, what she said about Giovanni character, well, you know what? Never mind. We'll have ample time to talk about this later. I don't want to bore you with this now. See you later, Stella. The Lynx is very catty. She's like an aristocrat that doesn't like... He got, got bored and decided to dabble into politics. An aristocat. Ah, ha, ha. Do you feel the heat, Munchkin? Do you smell the fragrance of the molten metals and heavy machinery? This is where magic happens. We are going to make some beautiful things in here. Let's go inside and I can explain how it works. I already know how it works. Mm -hmm. Beat you to it. Oh my, Stella, this is the first class foundry you've got here. Even I myself couldn't have done better. Simply stunning. Let me run you through the basics. It's a complex machine and you have to be careful about it. First, you have to lead, load ore into the furnace, then you have to load coal in the burner. Reach its working temperature, then whatever ore you deposited into the furnace will be smelted into ingots. The bellows on each side of the furnace will make me. Oh, yeah, yeah. Mm. Make sure the temperature remains at the right level. You don't want to see what happens when you go above. Have at it. Okay. Okay. Stella, come here! I'm working! I'm working on it! Next, you're gonna want me to build you a house. Boop, boop, boop. Oh, Stella, how I wished all the metal workers I've met were as gifted as you. You look so small and weak, but you dance around the smelter like a veteran forge master. I'm so proud of you. There's a splendid machine, and I'm sure you'll put it to good use. You learned something devastating about Kevin today? He's a screamer? Well, he works out. He's got an exhale. Got a... Plant the coffee. Plant the coffee. You don't have to yell. Yeah, you do. You gotta... Whatever you're lifting. He yells oink. Well, he's a pig. That's to be expected. I'd, I'd question if he was going meow or something. Or if he had wooed. A questionable meal. Huh. I said a woo. I said a woo.
Hacky sack. A nice cup of tea. Do it better. That was better here. I need to get myself a sheep. everyone else is. And you, uh, you can have some tea. That's not tea. That's a sandwich. Where'd you get that from? Doesn't like a tool's banging. Well, too bad. Here's a hug. No one likes the tools banging. The tool, where are you at? He's gone missing. Where is that frog? There he is. Arr! Have a... Have this. This is hot garbage. Ew. Alright, have some coffee. A little bit of a cox block going on right now. Valuable necklace. Well, I'm noticing. I'm looking at my frames dropped. Yeah. I'm in the red. It's like a weird cox block though, because my kilobits are still where they should be, but I'm still dropping frames. Come on. 
Come on, Cox. Come on, Cox. Good dropping my frames. Dropping about 40 frames every uh, every second. So you're only getting 20 out of 40. It's a cinematic experience now. There we go, now it's back. with me, sheep. I must corral you, I think. Sheep. Good sheep. I need linen fabric. I don't know how to make linen fabric. too cute for you. You want to play it too? It's on Steam. Let's go to the sky. I don't know if it's on the switch. It could be. It is possible.
Let's see here. Iron ingot. Ah. Cup of tea, governor. There you go. Turn up the char. There you go. Find and collect. There you go. Sockeye, soul, and a squid. Don't have any of that. But let me sell you some uh, valuable rings, a painting, carpets. Ooh, I can upgrade my ship now. Wonderful. Shark, 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 get to the shark. Upgrade, upgrade, upgrade. That's what I need, right? 8,000, yep, 8,000. Fish up old shoes like me. Grow, corn, grow! Grow! Get big! Okay, you're big. Coffee. 
And some tea. No, my muscles are burning. Put the sawdust in here. Here's some food. Popcorn. No hug. Okay, no hug. I get you. No hug. Snake? Snake is sleeping. Oh. It's sleepy time now. Ha! <laughs> it's adorable. Let's feed everyone toasted sawdust. No, I'm making coal. Strawberry. I just don't want you to get close right now. Don't touch me. More proof that uh, a tool is the best. Uh, let's see, where did I get? Brochure from the island. Furogawa. Did I go here already? Take a tour of the city. See the shops. Is the shrine? Take in the sights. Okay. Well, the two of us. Astrid's bungalow. I forgot to give you something. I found while flip the magazines. Iwashima countryside. Might be checking out your old friend Olga. I got a blueprint. Ah, Astrid's bungalow. But, uh,. I don't know how to make linen fabric. Yo, how you doing, Spanky? That's a nice garden. Knock, knock. Who's there? Lettuce. Lettuce who? Let us in, and you'll find out. <laughs> Didn't I make that joke earlier? Chicken coop lounge and a crusher. An icebreaker. Oh, I can make an icebreaker. Oh no. I can make a mailbox. The Dauntless Dolphin. Alright, well. My boat is even bigger now. Thank you, my sh my sharky friend. Now I can move stuff around. Damn, it goes tall. It goes way up there, don't it? Mm, if I can do like this. Factory like way up here. I mean, it's a lot of wasted space. I wonder if I can put kitchen like right here. Oh, I can. Big boat. Big boat. Hmm. Look at way up there. 
It's my boat. I can do what I want. <laughs> and I'm putting everyone way up there. <laughs> I don't care if it looks silly. <laughs> Good enough, I say. Good enough. I mean, shit, I gotta fit in a windmill and a, an orchid. An orchard. Oak plants. I already did that one. Still need the nebula thread. I don't know where that one Do I want to live in a treehouse? No. What's wrong with the sheep there? What? What? Uh. Mm -hmm. We'll say it's a bug. I, I don't know. a silly looking boat. I didn't do nothing to the sheep. He was just like that. Four alarm clocks. I did nothing. Wasn't it was it Toriyama? Yeah it was Toriyama. also this quest right here for Gwen. Let's go here. Let's find out. Let's, 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 let's proceed with the story, shall we? Ding, ding, everyone up. I know where I left all y'all. Yourself, uh, <laughs> some of that. You want some food, my man? Have yourself some, uh, cup of tea. Hey, thank you, time. I just love food. He eats the burgies. That's a cat. Are you jealous that I pet the cat? A letter you say from Olga? Oh, this is so nice of her. Olga had some news about Giovanna's whereabouts. Iwashima countryside, you say? Mm, okay, we should probably go take a look. And what? An inspiration for a house? For me? How thoughtful. Can't deny it. Olga knows me so well. Yes, indeed. I'd be very happy to have a nice den to live in. Always pleasant to, you know. Oh, go ahead, make me a house, please. Why don't you have the workers rise up and make it for you? 
you're so resourceful after all. Go ahead, build it. I know you can do it. I do not like that bobcat. Yeah, no, I can't make it yet. I need linen fabric, and I have no idea how to make that. Yeah, the hat is a blanket. Ooh, scallops. Time for the jellies. She's good at them backhanded compliments. Well, yeah. Not, not, not someone I would enjoy being around. Yeehoo! Got him, boys! Oh, my sawdust is done. Who's hungry? Some of that. Come on now, let me at him. Come on. Oh, okay. Where's my kitchen? Who's hungry for sawdust? Just kidding, it's cold. Make the planks. Uh, ooh, I need maple. No lightning. I'm sorry. I'm I'm a little busy right now. You see that? Perfect every time. Perfect every time. Perfect <laughs> every time. No. Sheep is dead. She was fluff. Y'all want to learn how to lose weight quick? You'll go from this to this in no time flat. Give me that muscles.
So I'm keeping a tool away from everyone. Because <laughs> all he does is bang. Everyone else is jealous. Stella, come here. No! Make me! I'll talk with Gwen. Gwen's cool. Gwen takes my hugs. She's got six ears. Ears, the better to hear me with. Via Magiori discovered. The via Magior. Mag Magior. 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 Maggie. Come out of here. Also, I noticed the cat didn't give me her obo yet. What's up with that? Everyone else just gave it to me right at the start. The cat's like, nah, I'll hang on to this. Too bad, so sad. How long has it been since we've been here together, Stella? Seems Jerry has been taking Jack Jerry good care of this premises. He's always been the best gardener we've ever had. Mum has not been home much since father died. Shit. <gasps> S-word! I'm much more emotional than I thought I'd ever be. I love this house so much, as much as I hated it, probably. But look, I don't think I can go in there, even with you. It's just, I can't. Go without me. I'll wait for you here. Here's the key. If you stumble upon my old music box, will you bring it back to me? Remember, this house has always been a real labyrinth. If you heard lost, you have to follow the light. Good luck in there. Oh, great. Ah, what's this you're hiding? I'm in here now! Where am I? Help! Feed the cat some fish. Last time she said it was dry. I did. It was the first thing I gave her was fish. And she's like, mm, it's dry. I don't like it. Hmm, I do declare this seems to be mm, the most worst. I thought dying was bad. That's what she told me. But she, that's what she said. that for me. Terry? Terry, is that you? Terry. Oh. Welcome, small traveler, to my humble palace. Everything I own is of the finest quality. Everything is also bolted down, so don't get any funny ideas. <gasps> Loom upgrade. There it is. I needed that. I'll get up there. No! It's all right. Loom upgrade. Now I can make fabrics. Found the box. Could you give it to me? Okay. Here you go. Thank you. I'll hold on to it. Oh, you found something else. Wow, I forgot we even had that. It's an old manual for a golden royale. Remember that they had won his first prize in the town's yearly tombola? Tombola? Tom tombola? Tombola. 
I dreamt of having this machine since second grade, but father would never let me participate in the lottery. This manual will come in handy. We can use it to upgrade the loom. You know, let's get back to the boat. We forget this place ever existed. Okay! Huh! Yeah! Let's get out of here! That was up, Stripe. Nah, never mind. Nostalgia's not my forte. I'm slightly happy the via, the villa, <laughs> the via, is still in good condition. Or is it? Mm -hmm. Alright, let's change the subject. You must have noticed the improved tab on your blueprint. Uh, mm -hmm. upgrade your loom. Okay. Yes. Yes. No, not edit. Improve. Where's it at? Where's it at? Where's it at? It's up here. Way up there. I need maple. God dang it! I need maple planks. Alright, hang on, hang on, hang on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I have like one. Yes. Perfect. Every time. Here we go. It was perfect. Don't say anything. It was perfect. And boom. Upgrade. Yeehaw. Brilliant! Now the loom is fully useful. Of course, many situations can be upgraded. Just You just have to find the blueprints for them and materials. I believe it's time for me to teach you the advanced loom techniques. There are a few improvements you can make to the machine itself. It depends on how you place your hand on the machine. How you arrange threads as you load it up has a big impact. With a few simple tricks, you'll be able to craft much more intricate items. Fabric. Let's go take a look. Craft fabric. Ah! This is what I've been waiting for! Hang on, I gotta water my plants. I'm ready! Weave! Uh. Oi! Uh, I win. I win. I win. I couldn't see. She blocked it. Little baby gang. You're a natural. Why am I not surprised? Research reached a pro level now. There's nothing more I can teach you. That being said, and if you don't mind, I'll give it a go myself. It'll definitely help me unwind a bit. Hey, there you go. Here, have some food. Some coffee. Mm. How's your mood? Visited childhood home. Doesn't like a tool. But everyone doesn't like a tool, man. What the hell? How can you not like a tool? Look at this big, look at this big fat baby. Look at this. Look at this big fat baby. How can you not like him? I am disappointed in my crew. He is a good boy. He is a good boy. He's the best of boys. I'm gonna improve. Well, let's see here. What can I... Now that I know how to make the uh, fabric... Oh, here we go. Astrid Bungalow. Why is it so big? Astrid, dearie. Please. It's This is huge. What's wrong with you? It's fine, it can be down there. Oh, cool! Mm, yeah, 
Yeah, sure, here you go. Throw those in there. Parkour! This is like the biggest... Yo, she got a billy bass! Wait, is she a cowboy? Was she on the ranch? Wait a second. I'll leave you be. Hmm. How you doing, Lillian? My boat's such a <laughs> setup, so just strange. It, it might be a little top heavy, just a teeny tiny bit top heavy. Whoa, well, we'll play, play, play. Uh, don't worry, though, it's fine. All right, where are we going? Let's see here. Whoa! I don't think I can get past that. Let's go back and purchase some uh, maple. I need maple. I need maple logs. Lots and lots of maple logs. Oh, wait, 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 hang on. Wait, hang on. Oh, get, get that. Everyone wake up. Astrid's got a dumpy ass. I'm surprised she can uh, navigate these ladders. You've got to be kidding me! This house is just fantastic. You know, I, I love simple things. Simple things that make me feel good and warm inside. What can I say? I just don't like when it's too complicated or luxurious. That's ironic. I just don't. That's who I am. I've always been like that, and as far as I remember, when I was young, many of my friends were pretty rich and famous. You know, artists, philosophers, sports athletes, I've always attracted the finest people. What can I say? But it didn't mean a thing back then, and still doesn't... Up to this day, it's probably why I ended up marrying Giovanni. He was so simple, yet so elegant. So genuine, but also funny and unpretentious. And he didn't have a dime to his name. Still doesn't, I guess. Mm -hmm. I gotta admit, I think I miss him. Mm -hmm. I know I shouldn't. I know he's worthless riffraff. Mm -hmm. I know he probably doesn't give a shit about me now. Oh, S-word. But, but I just can't forget about him. You think you could check the mail? Or maybe Olga's written to us about him. I'd be so grateful if you did. Thank you, Stella. I won't forget this. Yay. Here, have some, uh, have some shellfish. Okay, never mind. Uh, have a... Have a disgusting meal. You like plain dishes? Uh-huh. Is that an onion and cheese sandwich? Here's a hug. <laughs> that was a good hug, if I do say so myself. Looks like she's living in, like, the fireplace. She just set up a bed in there. Gotta go. Your face has a dumpy ass. No, 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 no. It's not true. Wow, berries. 
Thank you, a tool. Here you go. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, yes, it's good. <laughs> if you don't like a tool, you just get out. Get out now. Got all the maple. All that maple. So let's see, what are my upgrades? What can I do now? I can do. No, I can't do that. Mm, can't do that. I don't right. Who doesn't like the frogs? Mount Toriyama. Find a secret sheep and escort it back to Mount Toriyama's enclosure. Iwashima, countryside. Oh, uh, okay. Give Summer three gemstones. I got Citrine, uh, and I got an Opal. I don't have a Hematite, Amethyst, or Diamonds. I can give her two, though. A tool is best boy. Here you go. I have his lemon, too. <laughs> there you go. Citrine promoted motivation and activated creativity. Encourages self-expression and enhances concentration. Wow. Wow, amazing! That doesn't do any of that. Uh, an opal. A burning stone of passion and love. A stone of seduction which resonates with burning desire and releases inhibitions, but stabilizes emotions at will. In other contexts, opal also brings about loyalty and faithfulness. Oh, okay. It's a super... Uh, it's a super rock! Delightfully sugary perfection. So the snake died of diabetes, I bet. Look at the best boy. Look at him work. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him work. Let's see if I can improve my uh, my kitchen. Linen fabric. Okay, I can do that now. Linen fabric will be improved. Let's do that real quick. I think I have enough, right? He works the wood, that's right. Oh, whose idea was to put this shit up here? Oh, I don't have anything. Shit. No! Need more linen. We will go to the blueprint chest. Probably on the roof. I couldn't get to it. Oaks, 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 oaks. Let's find out what this thing is. Krogawa, Toriyama. I can do that one. Let's go to Mount Toriyama. Stella, come here! Stella! Get over here! No! Leave me alone! I need more linen seeds, that's what I need. No, play, play, play.
Hello, X-Ray. Good night, X-Ray. Cat is singing, yes. Give me that linen. More linen. The coffee can wait. I noticed if Gwen didn't get in my way, I would have had enough fabrics. How dare she! Uh, not this time. Another time. Another time. I must improve. Yes, upgrade. Wow! The full potential has been unlocked! You got it done quickly, Sprout. Thanks for taking the time. A good kitchen is a good investment. You'll see. You won't regret it, I promise. My stomach either. Thank you. Okay. Ah, now I can cook recipes. Where's that wonton soup I picked up a while ago? Rice flour and meat. Don't have that. All right, so how about... Um, what do you guys think? Uh, fish plus carrot, maybe? Let's do uh, mackerel plus carrot. Try that. What's going on up here? Way up here. There's something else I wanted to talk to you about. I'm still really grateful to you for having such allowed me to reside in such a nice cabin, but I must admit it's still a bit empty. It's not like surrounded by pointless tacky things, but in a house like this, I believe we could do something very special, unique. Class and coziness, what do you think? A little bit of improving will be fabulous. Okay. Wow! Wow! Yo, parkour! Yeah! Let's see here. Can I improve our house right now? Oh, I can actually. Here you go. Need more maple planks. I do have maple planks, though. Ha-ha! Why is it so zoomed out? Wait, hang on! Uh, crate! 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 Wait, hang on! Up! Up! Uh. 
Apple seeds. Worth it. Perfect every time. I agree, Apollo. And there you go. Whoa! Fully improved Gwen. What about uh, a tool? Can I improve a tool? I need slate. Aluminum. Ash. What about the snick? I need a leak. I don't know where leaks are from. And then she needs zinc. Cotton. <laughs> nope. None of that. Fire glow. Let's see. We have created Bulabasi. Booya Bussi. What if I do lettuce and squid? I don't know, make some lettuce wraps or something? I don't know, I don't know. I don't know! Bibway? Let's see, put some... Ooh, put some rice down. There you go. Sheep with me. It does look like she's sleeping in a fireplace. I don't think I can take that sheep with me. I don't know. I think I need to actually get that technique for, uh, Oh no, there you go. The sheep follows me. Good job! Uh, you, you brought me a second sheep. Oh, look at them. They'll be so happy together. Huh? Oh, they're acting kind of coldly. That's surprising. Well, they just have to get to know each other. I'm sure they'll be best of friends in no time. As for me, well, it was nice feeling needed. What? You want me to join you in your travels? Oh, no, 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 no. I couldn't possibly impose myself on all of you. Besides, I'm sure there's no room for me. Oh. For sure, this island is a little bare, but I'm sure a little house could fit quite nicely here. A little bungalow with nice vines and potted flowers, maybe, with pale tones and cozy cottage facade. Oh, and green window shades. My, that would be so wonderful. Oh, sorry, I was lost in my train of thought. No, you go ahead, I'll be fine here. Alice, huh? What do you think Alice is? What are these weird two people? They're spirits. Remember, I'm I'm deaf. And I'm assuming this is like uh, purgatory, this whole everything. And it's my job to ferry people who are ready to uh, their final destinations. about corn and I guess corn and turnip turnip <laughs> corn and turnip oh hey there's a leak lettuce and carrot Now 
That cat has the thou Daffodil has the thousand yard stare right now. I've seen some shit. Let's see. What is this house? Linen and iron. Oof, I don't have iron. Damn, what a shame. Alice is going to be a dog? Ah, it might be. It's a sheep herder. I need iron, though. I don't know how to get... I need to find iron somewhere. Iron ingots. Let's see. What is... Well, a quarry. <laughs> a quarry might have it. Let's find out what... Uh... I can't go over there yet. I got this... These rocks in my way. I'm assuming that's ice. Cowsteen mines. Let's go. Uh, let's go see what this is. Who's hungry? Ooh, a grain salad. I know someone who's gonna like that. What about coffee and... That's it. Coffee. What about tea? Nope. Corn and... A herring? Oh, I gotta wake everyone up. Hang on! Everyone, wake up! Ding, ding! What the hell was that? My stomach's rumbling. Feed an army, I need a little pick me up. You're a bit embarrassed to say you only watched my Rainwolf video before? Hey, it's all good, man. A bunch of pork chops. Access to my kitchen, my spices, and market back home, I could whip up something. Stores, what's possible up here? Make it up as you go along. Mm, wise words as great grandma once told me. What a lady. Ooh, pork chops. Yum yum. A tool, get out of here. No, it, it, a tool. Stop. Hey, uh, friend, no, 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 no. Sorry, we brought it up. I'll go stand on the edge of the boat and take in the splendor, you know? No bugs will fly in my mouth. That's no fun. Here you go, a tool. Have yourself, uh. Bu Buyabasi. Fine dining soup. Oh boy! Shame on them? No, no shame on them. So, you play as Death, and it's your job to ferry souls to the next stage of the afterlife. I'm assuming this is purgatory, so. I'm, uh leading spirits to complete whatever stuff that they've uh, left behind or not weren't it wasn't able to do you know just making them so their passing is uh, easier oh fish curry they're all furries too Fine dining. She does not like fine dining. Exotic. There you go. Fish curry. And then you can hug them. What do you do? Harvest ore. Use a smelter. It's all about making the dead spirits happy. That's right. The house looks so much better. As if everything was designed with my happiness in mind. The textures, the tones, the coziness, it's perfect. Look at you listening to me and building such a nice cabin. I won't forget this. Whoa! It's 
Snick. There you go, Snick. Grain. So what is this area about? Is there like something I'm missing? Because there was like a sea slug thing. Where's that at? Maybe I fish it up. Oh, message in a bottle. All right, message in a bottle. Whatever it was. Nebula pill bug. Ah, okay. So that's where you get the nebula fibers from. I guess I missed it. Oh well. Give the tool some pork chops. Yes, this, this game is extremely, extremely expressive. It's fantastic. Let's see here. Pork chops. No, I just need pork. I don't know where to get my pork! Rah! <laughs> I've got a surprise! I was hungry as usual, so I did something about it. I went outside the boat and gathered some berries. But I went a little overboard. I have too much. Here you go. Have a berry day! This is why our tool is the best. Osiki Quarry Discovered. Stella, come here. I'm happy you found me, and I'm happy you're able to help these poor souls in the factory. The workers deserve better, and the ruling class will never change. A bunch of swines that they are! They are the same as you know. They all pretend they're superior because of blah, 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 blah. Okay, bye. The Aristocat. But oh, no, no, no. She likes it plain. Plain stuff. Plain. You know, I wish the snake would water the fields, too, and not just sing to them. Waters need more than just singing. Water needs more than just... Damn it! Plants need more than just water. Or singing. Ah! Ah, no, you cool, Jimmy. I'm all about the request, my man. That's what the variety is all about, baby. I think I'm supposed to twain that guy over there. I really don't feel like it. I've been really tired over the past week or so. I can't sleep at night. Let's just hope well, he gets the hang of the job without my help. This is iron? Give me some iron, baby! Slate? Uh, well, I need slate. Well, it's my first day on the job. I have no idea what I'm doing. No one is training me. The place is falling apart. You 
gonna... No? There we go. Okay. Oh. Ah, here's the iron. She's like, ooh, I love it. Nice. I'm picking up some more. That must also be another skill. The zip line. What did you say? What'd you do? They banned you. No, they didn't ban you. The word idiot is, uh, not acceptable! Alright, you got, you, alright, you got to get together, Gary. This is your day. Today's about digging. Any problems you have, leave at the door. This is a new day. Big breath. Sequence. Ah, amethyst. Miniature diorama. No, Apollo didn't get banned. It's just, it's funny. Um, so, YouTube, they block certain messages sometimes for quote-unquote bad words but i can still see it through the restream chat so i see apollo say something but it doesn't show up on the youtube chat i'm like hmm it's like hmm oh a diamond Arr! My manager is really stressed out. He told me to be quiet today. I shouldn't even be talking to you. I guess now I can give all those uh, gemstones to... Uh, uh, what's her face? Snake. I prefer YouTube or Twitch. Um, honestly, I prefer DLive because DLive actually uh, allows me to be uh, partnered. I guess technically YouTube I am as well, but Twitch says no no to restreaming. Oh no, come on. I've been practicing my business face and all. Hopefully they notice me in all the darkness from this mine to the boardroom. Moving on up, baby. Twitch does not like multi-streaming at all. Well, they don't care. They're just, you're not allowed to be an affiliate or a partner if you multi-stream. You can imagine it's always news. That's what the boss says at the meetings. Oh, all this iron, I love it. Yeah, DLive is pretty streamer friendly, that's true. It's like the one of the first things that um, they uh, they said was like, if you restream, hey, we love that. They said, go right ahead, do what you do best. Wow. Ooh, mushroom. Hang on. Give me that mushroom. Don't say the S word either. And the V word and the I word. Look, Stella, I'm sorry. 
I think I just need some space. Just a bit of time by myself. I know going back to the villa was a bad idea. It doesn't have anything to do with you. You've been nothing but great since you found me on that island. I just need to be alone for a little while. Oh, okay. Bye. Build. Alice's cottage. Iron ingots. Was there something I need to improve? It was a, a tool, wasn't it? I give him a shower now. Yes. I need linen, linen, linen. Yes. The 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 silly word, not the sims silly, not the Simpsons. <laughs> what was this something I needed slate for? I didn't think it's. Look at this! Look at this good boy! Look at this good boy! Look at him! Look at him! These simpletons, am I right? Am I right, lad? <laughs> but, you know, you're not, not allowed. Well, they say you're not allowed, but, you know, you can't really trust their word for it based on their track record. You absolutely cannot base <laughs> trust their word. Just need this linen real quick. I guess D Live has like the most freedom out of uh, all three of the uh, the ones I stream off of. I mean, like the only rule for D Live is like don't be uh, don't be aggressively harassing people. That's pretty much it. You know the the calling for you know being big meanie poopy heads. The other two are like, hmm, I don't know, maybe you kind of implied it. Or maybe you didn't, I don't know. Yeah, the cat singing, uh, Daffodil is the cat's name. Put down some coffee. And some tea. And some coffee. Some leeks. Cat DLC one. Who knows? Maybe sooner than you think. Yep, D Live is pretty chill. This is true. I'm gonna put my eye finger in there. Fire it up, boys! Really, uh, really should have done this when um, I was traveling. I don't, that's what I was, I was about to say. The cat's not helping. Come on, cat, get on the other side. Push down. Go. 
Poof. 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 Ah, now pick it up with your bare hands. Whoa! Alright, let me go travel, and then I'll uh, I'll do that and do the next one. Multitask. <laughs> My boat setup is so stupid. <laughs> Top and front heavy. One rogue wave. Just tipping over. Going down. Oh, that's right. Death can't feel pain, of course. Silly me. Whoa! Oh, the dragon. Um, spirit? Yeah, this one. Not Toriyama. Wake up, everybody! Up and at him. Yeah, the YouTube algorithm is very, uh, very, I don't want to say strange, but people have, uh, studied it and found ways to, um, take advantage of it. I've noticed, I was looking at my analytics and, like, 80% of my YouTube views are people not subscribed. <laughs> I'm like, oh, great. I think it's just because of the Rain World um, final sequence or whatever. Or other Rain World videos, you know. But people watch what they want to watch, right? Alright, let's see here. Build a oh, linen. Oh shit, I need linen. <laughs> no fursuit, no sub. <gasps> what? <laughs> you furry. Yoink. Yoink. Give it a linen. Suppose a doghouse. Maybe. The coziest cottage. Aluminum, glass, and wool. Alright, let's see what this, uh, this spirit is. I'm guessing, uh, a dog. When's the daddy long legs cosplay? That's gonna that's a sticky situation. So we got we got a we got dog as a guess. What? You built a house for me? You shouldn't have, really. But since it's there, well, I guess it's uh, it'd be rude for me not to move in. Thank you so very much, sweetheart. Are the sheep gonna you know? Stay on this island? Mm. Oh, back so soon? I'm always happy to see you, sweetheart, but don't let me hold you back. Alright, let's see who we got. What is this? Ah, little ceremony. All right, I'll try to do my best. <gasps> Is that a possum? Oh. Or a hedgehog? What is that? What is that? Is that a possum? 
soft as the waffle and warm as pie. I feel young again. So, so, wee! I think it is a possum. We got to see the tail. It is a possum. Wait, no, it's a hedgehog. Damn it. I was excited for a second. It's a hedgehog. No, no way. Close though, but not, not close. I guess it didn't like its new companion very much after all. Well, no worries, we'll, we'll take good care of you. But first, all this wool it looks quite uncomfortable, doesn't it? And, oh no, we're on a boat. It's like that story with a flock of sheep that fell off a boat. Oh, we can't have that. Go ahead, Stella, shear the wool right off its back. It's for the best. Okay. That expression. Ah! <laughs> it dropped a key. <laughs> key for Mount Toriyama. All right. Here, have a hug. Oh. Mm. Oh, that was very nice. Thank you. Yeah, gotta go fast. Yeah. Have a berry. I'm not hungry. Okay. Well, what do you like? Alice was recently hugged. Has a nice house. Cooks food for you, takes up burnt food, shops for ingredients, picks fresh fruit. Much better. Aren't you feeling better? It's much safer, too. And that key, I thought I had lost it. But it was stuck in your thick coat all this time. What a treat! As for you, Stella, I know you'll find a good use for all this extra wool. It's one of my favorite materials I chose exclusively for all my blankets. My husband, of course, always thought they were itchy. He was such a grump. The sheep's wool will grow back very quickly, but only if it's well fed. And this one seems to have quite a large appetite. I suggest you diligently feed them, otherwise he might get into your garden and destroy your crops. Building a sheep corral would help him. Well, I did already. For the good of the sheep and your crops. Hedgehogs are dirty little creatures. At least hedgehogs in the wild are, are, are filthy, dirty creatures. Like that. Like that. Oh, make sure I, I gotta give the, uh, I gotta upgrade and give, give stuff to the snick. I can improve. There you go. Now I can... Maybe I'll upgrade. I'm gonna find that somehow. Okay. Whoa! Whoa! You get amethyst and a diamond. Here you go. An amethyst? What a treat. Amethyst are healing stones, you know. Ailments, emotional issues, nightmares, and other afflictions can be cured with the power of an amethyst. They're great for the balanced chakra as well. Specifically, the crown chakra. Oh, I just needed to give three. And with that last gem, my basic medicine cabinet is complete, and since my meditation room is already finished, finished with a nice little altar, you can come by and admire it at any time. Truly grateful. So, Hugo. I got myself a hedgehog and uh, a, 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 a bobcat. Also, oh hi doggy. I've heard of a nice spot in Mount Toriyama on a cliff overlooking the horizon. I think it would make a nice classroom. Well, I'm already here, so hey!
Set sail! I was excited because the hedgehog I thought was a possum, but uh, he's a hedgehog. What a nice quaint place. And the view, it can't be beaten. This will be perfect. I see a little promontory up on that cliff there. Just go ahead and I'll beat you there. How will I do it? Don't worry, I'm sure I'll manage to snake my way up there. Unlocked. Secrets. Ceramic bowls and cherry seeds. There's the, uh, the bobcat. Here, have some popcorn. Snake has arms? No, it's just the curls. Yeah, they can all climb and stuff like that. That was a good hug. You know, like when a snake curls or curls its body, it makes loops. It's the snake curls. Like six total. One, two, three. And then let's try one, two. And then one. Yep, six. Your video quality went down. Oh, I shot! Doing all right on my end. YouTube suppressing me as usual. <laughs> Whoa. Have some, uh, here, have some popcorn. So you can, uh, so it's the tail and like the curl. That knave algorithm. algorithm. Well, I mean, if I wanted to uh, abuse the algorithm, all my videos would be about 10 minutes. That's it. supposed to do here. Might as well be all right. I feel tricks up my sleeve. And beating younglings in a climbing race has always been a specialty of mine. But enough about this. Let's focus on the matter at hand. This lesson, as you might have guessed, will be a little special. Up till now, we focused on proper care to plant and crops. Well, now I think it's time to concentrate on the proper care of one's mind. Sunlight and music were the tools of the former. For, for the latter, our tool will be the act of meditation. And that's specifically why I brought you here. 
She is Balder and has been consecrated for nothing. Powerful spirits energies flow through the area. I know it might seem strange, occult even, but just humor me. First thing first, sit down next to me just like this. Alright, your turn. Okay. Meditation, Stella, is an affair of the wholeness. Of wholeness and oneness. A lot of novices believe wrongfully that meditating is the pursuit of an empty mind. But a mind is not empty. It is a beast, savage and untamed. Violent and caring. Loving and destructive. Hateful, curious, scared. A ball of frayed nerves. Much like the dragon, it cannot be controlled. It must be allowed to roam free. My father also lived with this tormented creature, of a different kind, perhaps. He chose to fight it. Tried to muscle it down into submission. The market under the auspice, auspice of violence, and mostly to silence it. He thought that nothing, nothingness was the solution. But the dragon is indomitable. The fight left my father a broken man. Let your mind wander, Sarah. Gently, like you would a scared kitten. Let it smell the grass. Let it notice the wind flowing through your hair. The heart radiating from the stone behind you. The rhythmic breaking of the waves below. Let your spirit penetrate all things. Not to make them yours, but to make yourself theirs. Be one and be whole. But keep being. Give me that. Woo! Sheep, come with me. Wait, I'll shear you. Here you go. Ah, I can take this sheep with me. My lessons had quite the influence. You were up there for hours. I just had to stretch my legs at some point. Oh, what were? What are you saying? A vision? Of course. You're the spirit fair, after all. The mystical energies of this world are bound to affect you in mysterious ways. I'm sure there are such areas of power. If you find them, be sure to take the time to meditate. Perhaps more visions will rain down upon your mind. You know, Stella, while you were up there, I tried to do some thinking. I wanted to prepare for our next lesson. There's still so much to teach, but I couldn't think. My mind was uneasy, for you see, I too have had vision. A gift from the universe. It's the dragon, Stella. I have felt him creeping slowly towards me. I thought I had some grand purpose to accomplish before he would swallow me whole. But now I realize that the dragon hasn't crept much at all. He has kept up with me for quite a while now, and ignoring it won't do me any good. Let's go, shall we? The snake is silly when she talks about her legs. <laughs> when, she, when she was first introduced, she was uh, tea posing. Here, have some, uh, have some fish. You know, the uh, that hedgehog looks like a Disney character. <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> She cooks food for me, though. I cook food for me. Something needs rice. Rice plus something. Squid skewer, no. Pork chops, no. Rice flour plus meat is wonton. But I don't have flour. I have just rice. Okay, what about just rice and... and a mackerel. Oh, 
A tool! He does not need no... He doesn't need any ladders. He's probably hungry. Oh yeah, he's famished. Here you go, my man. Pork chops are the way to my heart. Oh, I didn't ring the bell. Cat's still sleeping. Um, here, have have some berries. Plain food. This is an entire village built on a boat, yes. It's my, uh, my death boat. I am death. Literally, I am death. <laughs> Hiroshima Lighthouse. Didn't get there yet. I mean, we can uh, go check out uh, Furugawa. They do. They do work. They uh, they do actually work. Uh, when you get when they increase in ooh, fish curry, when they increase in uh, I guess mood, um, they do more chores for you. Like the snake sings to the plants, which increases their growth. The frog does. The frog does the wood cutting. The cat does the uh, ore refinery. Uh, the deer does the loom. No freeloaders here. Yep, I am the spirit fairer. I ferry the spirits. Ah, I've been looking at my house as a little bare bone. As an amateur handyman, this doesn't work at all. Maybe we should improve it, add a few bells and whistles. I don't know what exactly, let me have a look. Follow me! You already started with improvements? Carry on. <laughs> yes, they're dead. I mean, they're dead. And they know they're dead, I think. But I guess it's more comforting to, you know, eat. Or make it seem like you're eating. Not sure, you know, I mean, it brings a sense of calmness, and we're, we're here to make the spirits as calm as possible. Hello, my Russian friend, how you doing? Clean that boat up. the other sheep at? Yeah, sheepy, sheepy, sheepy. Hmm. <laughs> <sighs> 
Excuse me. I live a simple life. Okay. Hi there. Where is my brother? He should be here. Here's someone. Uh -huh. Oh, what impeccable timing. I am in dire need of assistance. I can tell from your friendly and familiar face that you are un undoubtedly the helpful type. Uh -huh. Listen, I'm looking to complete this set of five traditional woodprints. They date from the Ushira, Ushiro period, and as such are invaluable. I found four of them, but alas, the last one eludes me. I'm certain it is in this very village. Furthermore, I'm absolutely positive that it was recently in the possession of the local shopkeeper, Theodore. But he refused to even acknowledge it existed. Alright, who do you guys think this is going to be? What kind of animal? Uh -huh. What an irksome little man. A raccoon. Tanuki. Uh -huh. Whatever he is. But with your help, yes, with that sweet little smile of yours and generally non-threatening attitude, uh -huh. I can, you can schmooze your way to acquire the last precious piece. An owl. That's a good guess, actually. Go ahead, Skipper. I can't wait. A bat, an owl. Welcome to the world-renowned Furugawa Tours. The tour will begin shortly. Takes about five minutes and covers the rich history of the city. All right. The life of the party to ever attend one. Yeah, let's do it. Perfect. Let's start right away. A powerful symbol erected to keep evil spirits away and bless this island for future generations. You can sometimes see islanders stop by this tree in the middle of their journey home, maybe to remind themselves of a lost brother or their sick child, past lovers, Legend does say that they have some heard that they have heard of sometimes. Another piece of the island's rich culture. I personally have never experienced loss. Some say I always think of my personal problems, never thinking of others. Oh, no matter as long as I can carry on doing these tours. Okay. Stop that. Go away! Stop chasing me! Help! Since this is a vibrant city, we have a raccoon ink location. Considered by most to be the finest source of materials and wares, it is also coincidentally the only merchant business in town. Founded by Theodore Raccoon, these shops are a staple of a thriving economy. A fun little fact, anyone who joins Raccoon Inc. must legally change their name to Theodore. I suppose it's a way to honor their founder. Truly a sign of devotion. I myself do not shop at this particular establishment. I make my own clothes and furniture. This isn't particularly noteworthy, but it is a small tidbit of your tour guide life. Glide! Whoa! The power of the T-Pose! This shrine was built using only the finest metals. From the ashes of the past guardian tower, these shrines tell the story of our past. And that story is... Uh, give me a second. I'm not sure. Which is why it's important. In my forgetfulness, I remember the purpose of this shrine. The moral being, of course, always remember your heritage. A powerful thought. Let's move on. This concludes our tour. Furugawa Tours is grateful for your participation. Thank you for your ears and your patience. Thank you again. And gratuity is expected if you enjoy the tour. Does 500 Glim sound fair? Yeah, sure, here you go. Amazing! I knew you had an educational spirit. Thank you for believing in my teachings. Where's the cat? Yeah, where's the cat gliding? I don't think the cat, cat can glide. Well, the cat should be allowed to glide. I never want to go back home. Being here is the blind. 
If you wanted to stay at my place, you're more than welcome. Here's my key. If the door stays jammed, you just have to give it a good tug. It always gets stuck. I want to enjoy this view forever. I can glide. I can glide. I can glide. Oh, I thought that the hedgehog has no pupils. I'll be throwing some ingredients. Maybe I'll cook something for you later. Here, have a hug. Hello there, customer. Is our catalog not to your satisfaction? Are you interested in some specialized item? Oh, a woodprint, you say? Yes, yes, I know it. I It sat in my special stock for an eternity, and then suddenly everyone was looking for it. At first, it was very pan pandemic person, very rude. And worse, they were haggling on everything. They didn't even tell them the, of the print. Gave them some junk instead. And then later, this giant walrus lady came in and demanded that I sell it to her. The thought crossed my mind to start a bidding war, but she offered me some serious coin for it. That lady, let me tell you, she was loaded. Anyway, that's all I know about it. I can't help you with the print, but feel free to browse my wares. Pork chop. Uh, linen. And rice. Oh, he's happy. I will sell you... Mm, ooh, damn. Stabs your hand whenever you hold it. So clear and shiny, it's a wonder it's worth anything. I don't know if I should sell these, though. I can sell a couple of these. We'll buy... Uh, an apple seed, yes. Rice seeds, yeah. More hugs. Secrets. I know they're out here. Uh -huh. Ah, you're back. Did you manage to get the missing print? No, it was already sold, but how? Wait, is there a competing art collector roaming about? A walrus lady, you say? Of course! Of course it was her. Oh, that horrid women. That dim-witted, egotistical, patronizing charlatan. She called herself the collector, if you can believe it. She doesn't even collect anything. Oh, I'm sure she bought the print only to spite me. I should have never told her about my collection. That ugly ass sack face. Uh -huh. Well, I'm not one to wave away competition. The ugly witch is in hiding. In hiding from you! I don't specifically know why, but the news of uh, the new spirit fair made her skitter away like a puny cockroach. How fitting. Yes, yes, you're the spirit fair. Tell me something I don't know. She should have known better than to tell me the location of her hideout, though. She's hiding at these coordinates. Pay her a visit, would you? And when you see her, show her this figure. She'll know. Believe me, she'll know. This? Oh, do not worry. It's just some junk Theodore gave me. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Dude, chill! A very quaint figurine. Okay. Negative 150, 150, right?
got some moves. I come up here to see everyone from up high. Everyone is so small. I feel big and strong. If you run into my mom, just don't tell her I'm up here. I want this feeling to last a little longer. Whoa, rice seeds! I gotta get up to that. Which I think I probably have to go all the way back here. Oh, there's something right there, too. Signed Vintage Poster. Magic Mystery Parade 1967 Classic. Should be sold. Alright. Air numbs. You drop very quick. I wonder if I slide off that roof. Actually, be it. Hang on. Give it a little slide, then glide. Hmm, not enough. All right. Moving on. Hey, go, Jimmy. A letter from Albert. Dear valued customer, we are running a special promotion closed in a new type of building and all all part of our new Funtacular series, an air draft device. Enjoy your time soaring through the air. Ah, cool. Right there. I need a nebula fabric, though. Now I can cook some pork chops, though. And no problem, Jimmy. No problem. You take care of yourself. Drop down some rice. Dump down some leaks. Bloom up this. Uh, she's gone for a while. Oh, sheep.
tool. You just wait right there, my man. I got some pork chops for you. so damn tasty and they are you're a miracle you know that oh it's just so good now i feel a bit guilty and i'm sorry you're running all these culinary errands for me look there's this kid at work craig we used to have these long and tight union negotiations all nighters everyone would be at a standstill everyone was so hungry and every restaurant was closed I would send Craig to one of these endless 24-hour grocery store crawls for me. I would ask for these impossible gets, saffron, sumac, and even anise. It was something like 2 o'clock in the morning. Our goal was to make the tastiest chops in the world. A meal for everyone. On both sides of the table. To calm heads and to appease stomachs. The first part didn't always work, but everyone was always well fed. I don't know how he did it, but Craig would always find everything on my list. I would joke with him that he would have to break into people's houses to get the stuff. <laughs> Maybe he did. I don't know how he did it, Sprout. You made it taste like home. Here's to you and Craig. There he goes. Have yourself a coffee. <laughs> That's no coffee. All right, here's a hug. Good, indeed. I needed that. Come here, Stella. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Leave me alone. Large empty nook in my house. You know what? You, sh you should add a wardrobe. Fancy dresser for your clothes. You don't seem to have anywhere to store your own outfits. Perfect opportunity. Wardrobe. Sure. That yellow and green kind of uh, need improving. Oh, it's for her. Never mind. Well, here you go. Yellow and green. Ooh. Color combo. You're spoiling me, Stella. What an incredible piece of furniture. It livens the room so much. It's much cozier now and filled to the brim with clothes and accessories. You know how happy that makes me. What are you waiting for? Jump out of those old dirty clothes. Pick something with some jazz to it. Ooh. Oh, good. Oh, cool. I have not unlocked anything, apparently. Oh, there we go. Mustard. Ooh. <laughs> you like yellow and green? It's just... Mustard and teal. And, uh, don't go that well together, I think. I'm just saying. It's a modern choice, very youthful. What about something more classical? I think there was a nice periwinkle outfit in the bottom drawer. Try it on. Okay. 
poiple. Isn't that so much better? It's like an old grandma. I see now. You look adorable. I can seat you up. Plenty more for you to try on. Don't be shy. Come over anytime. I always love doing these little fashion shows with my granddaughter. Oh, what is it? You found an envelope at the bottom of the drawer? How peculiar. Well, don't make me wait. Open it. What is it? You say pictures and letters? Oh, those are mine. How did you ever end up here? What a mystery. My hundred handwriting. Oh, it's messy, all right. He was never a delicate man. But quite handy and very loving. Oh, and would you look at that? My backyard. See all these trees? Sweet Eugene planted a tree for every one of our children. And then for our grandchildren. We grew apples, cherries, pears. I remember my granddaughter playing in her mother's apple tree. Such sweet memories. Look at me rambling again. Go ahead, sweetheart. I won't hold you back any longer. Princess. I like the red hat more. Plum. Yeah. Whoa! I mean, it's nice you can change everything. That's great. Easier to see the cat now, too. <laughs> Daffodil. You have a. Um, you're vegan, so you get a berry. A berry. plays joyful music. What does this house need? Aluminum, ash plank bottled, ectoplasm. So, uh, nothing yet. Ash, you can get cotton fabric. I can do that one. A TV. It's fully upgraded. That's fully upgraded. That's upgraded. Don't know where those are. Nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing there. And nothing there. Alright. We'll call that a day. My friends, thank you for joining. I hope to see you again another time. Take care of yourself. Stay safe and awesome. Take care and bye-bye.